Anna, it's Ben. I met with the doctor. Looks like the neuropazine shortage is worse than we realized. But I found an alternative, another drug, something called Rhizine. It seems to do the same job. You took it? How do you feel? Better. First time in days I haven't had a pounding headache. But I only got enough for one dose. So I'm going to the local limb clinic to track down some new ones. I have a contact there. Be careful. Limb runs ID checks on all of their clients. If they figure out who you are... Don't worry. I've got it under control. Good luck.
announced that they have found a method of curing AIDS in mice.
This shipment has to get out tonight, or else El Jefe ain't. Algo. Do his own name, you know. 
Corporations that keep the augmentation continue to rise. Indeed, market growth is what controls Who holds the patent? What happened? Did you find Luis? I'm sorry, but I was too late. Luis is gone. Gone? Luis is gone? It's all my fault. I told him to take that job. Because of the new post. Luis is dead. Because I needed a fix. Oh God. How am I supposed to get new post without him? I'm sorry. I know what it's like. At least you tried. Thank you for trying. Here, take this. It's a nice night out tonight. I used to live in the slums, but I got out. I got my family out. The patent 
or anti-rejection drug neuropathy. Shows you. As scary as it can be to get enhancements, it's even scarier to go People need to understand that this is the way of the future. Welcome to Limb International. Liberty in mind and body. How may I help you? I'm here to see Dr. Cardoso. Okay. If you'll just tap your preferred client card on the reader, I can let you through. Your preferred client card has been rejected. Are you Dr. Cardoso? Who are you? What do you want? How do you know my name? A mutual friend sent me. Alvarez. He said you might be able to help. Come in. If you're looking for Camila, she's down the hall. I'm looking for a resupply of new pos, but Alvarez's stock is dry and you're my only option. That puts you in a tough spot, doesn't it? I haven't seen hardware like yours in a while. Maybe we can work something out. I am the manager of this limb clinic. 
But you probably knew that already, didn't you? So then, what should I be calling you? Name's Ben. I guess you could call me a freelancer. Well, Ben, I'm afraid you've come at a difficult time. This clinic used to be a thriving community of augmentation engineers and physicians. We were really pushing the boundaries with cutting-edge technology, making a better world. But things changed. Government sanctions and trade embargoes are crippling us. Only the very rich can afford augmentation therapy now. And with the neuropocene shortage, ordinary people are being forced to take desperate measures. That's how it goes. As long as the people at the top get what they want, it doesn't matter if millions of people become slaves to the drug companies. Dependency on anti-rejection drugs is not slavery. But I take your point. If this clinic is to survive, then I need to take action. And I could use some help from someone with your obvious qualifications. Are you interested? Tell me what you have in mind, then I'll tell you if I'm interested. Every day, I'm losing people. I don't know what kind of operation Zafire Biotech has going, but their rising is all over the black market. My clients are eating it up. Someone has to be held accountable. Somehow, the gangs in the slums are getting hold of shipments of the drug meant for clinical trials, and they're selling it on the street. God knows what they're cutting it with. If someone could get into gang territory and figure out how they're getting the rising? Someone like me, you mean? I have a contact at the train station who deals with the gangs. He's a gun runner, calls himself Cobra. He knows how they operate. If you want to help me, go see him first. It's very important that I find out where the rising originates. I need to know if it's coming from Zafire. Or, if it's not the real thing, if it's some poison the gang is cooking up, they could do terrible damage. That's a tall order, Dr. Cardoso. Why should I risk my neck for you? Because you don't have a choice. If you want neuropazine, I'm the only game in town. I see your point. Fair enough. Okay, I'll do it. But don't back out of your commitment. Thank you, Ben. You're doing the right thing. Anna, it's me. Listen, I found a new source. If everything goes well, we shouldn't have to worry about our new pulse supply for a long time. That's good news. Wait, if what goes well, Somebody needs help dealing with a local trash problem. Nothing's ever easy, is it? Okay, keep me posted. And don't make too much trouble. I'll do my best. Oh, they're right there, citizen. Looks like you're packing some serious hardware. You must be an agent. Government? Military? People who ask those types of questions don't usually end up living long, healthy lives. Whoa, easy killer. I got an attack dog on my hands. Ha <laughs> ha. I need help from an outside agent. Someone like you. I'll make it worth your time. You've got my attention. What do you want? I'm working on a case involving illegal rising distribution in Panama. And I think I got my man, the Kingpin. His name is Alvarez Uraujo, local scumbag. Somehow, he's got a line on the stuff and is selling large quantities of the drug in the slums. And you want to put him out of business? We're pretty tolerant of low-level crime in the city. Recreational drug use, but this is completely different. Lots of people are dying. We've got bodies piling up in the streets. And now, they're trying to push this junk downtown. That can't happen. So what do you want me to do? Take him out? Nothing like that. I just need evidence to make a bust. See if you can make contact with this lowlife. And then search for evidence. 
a list of customers, receipts, a pocket secretary would do the trick. If I take care of this for you, what do I get? Well, besides the warm fuzzy feeling of making the world a better place, how about cold hard cash? I'll do it, but if I get you the evidence you need, you better not stiff me. You got my word. Reporting to you, live from Icas. Turning now to Australia. Copy that. My eyes are real. More and more outbreaks seem likely. 